Hey guys, Luigi Taco here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pikmin 2. In the last part, we finished the Bull Black's Kingdom and Day 6. In this part, we are going to be going into the Perplexing Pool once again to take down some caves. Alright, and that was the last week-long hiatus I'm going to have for quite a while. So, I'm really sorry about all that happened over the summer, about all the summer camps I went to, which was a pretty big amount. But, it's all over, don't worry, no more hiatuses for a while. I know I've said that a lot, but this time, I truly mean it. So, yeah, everything's gonna be pretty good from now on. Alright, there are some things I want to start out with. First of all, I'm gonna try to raise up my blue numbers just a little bit. I'm just gonna get 20 yellows out. Today's gonna be pretty much multitasking. Now, get this. This is my 10th recording of this episode. I am not joking at all when I say that. I'm not exaggerating. I'm not adding a couple more numbers. I am being completely serious. 10th recording. Anyway, enough about that. This thing you're going to want to kill because it has a treasure and it gives a crap ton of Pikmin. So, just throw your little guys on there. It should take it out. There we go. That was pretty fast. Alright, so, carry that. One, one, two. And I thought it used to drop two pellets. Two of these tens, but whatever. I'll take, I'll take one. Yeah, that is called a Toady Bloister. A weird name, I don't know where it came from, but... Yeah. Anyway, uh, its only attack is... It shakes... Well, not shakes, but... Its only attack is it shoots spikes out of its mouth. Now, that seems pretty scary and... Really devastating, but trust me, it's not. It only happens when your Pikmin are in front of his mouth, and since you're only attacking him from the rear... It doesn't happen very often, so that's a pretty pushover, pretty big pushover in this game. Alright, now this puzzle was seen in the Distant Spring in Pikmin 1. Now the Pikmin come off this thing kind of fast, so just to avoid them going in the water, you kind of want to use the C-Stick to pull them back a little bit. AD, what is it called? Aquatic, yeah, excuse me. Aquatic Mine, I always thought this was a Sonic Adventure 2 battle, um, reference, because Aquatic Mine, that's the same exact name as a stage there, but there really is no resemblance at all, so, and it kind of looks like the nose of a red Pikmin, if you think about it. Alright, I'll just have these guys working on that, and get this. Alright, so that little bulb, 25 Pikmin. That is not bad at all. That's a really good number for one little treasure. Or not treasure, but you know what I mean. So let me just plucketh all of these. And that bridge just got done, so... I'm actually going to... I How many do I have in the field? I have 31 with... Alright, and then... I believe I have some over there. Yeah. Alright, I think I have 42 Pikmin. Or 42 Blues. Now, I'm only going to need 25, because I'm going to try to take down a cave. Alright. There we go. Aw, oh, I took a flower with it. Whatever. Alright, I already got that number. No, get back here. Alright. Right now, I'm just assembling my numbers just so I can take down a cave in just a little bit. No big deal. We take... Alright, 15 will do. Okay, let me just flower these guys up. In a little bit. Actually, I can't really do that right now, but... Oh well. Ah, uh, wait, yeah, I can. Alright. I just gotta hope they don't fall in the water. Because that would really suck. Okay, there we go. All flowers. 
And now I'm gonna take all of my blue Pikmin. Wait. Actually. I actually gotta do something right before that. Um, yellows, take down this. Wait, what? Uh. Alright. Slackers, get working. Ah! Oh! I'm gonna try to throw it over. Oh my god, it actually works. <laughs> hey, what? You're not even touching it. Look at that. Physics. I will never understand you, Pikmin 2. So off. Oh, well. Well, right now I just gotta wait, so... Let me just cut to when they finish that. There! Alright, that took long enough. Anyway, take only your blues now. Because if you take your yellows, they're gonna drown. Now look here. There's a cave. But there's a rock on top of it. Large rocks. Really? When'd you find that out, buddy? Bring together, you've been cooperating well. Oh, well, thank you. Finally, you say something nice, you jackass. Free the shackless of the boss. Okay. Wait, Omar's the boss? I thought the president was. X is separating to change leaders. We can master teamwork. You would overcome any impediment. Whatever, ship. Whatever you say. Alright. All these Pikmin, I can just wait. Because... Wait for it. Alright. Well, that's drained, so now we can take any Pikmin into that cave. But... This is drained too! So literally, we can take any Pikmin into that cave. And anywhere around here. Now, really fast, I actually want to just get a treasure super fast. Alright, come on, Wallywog. Good boy. Now die. Alright. Good thing. Oh, give a five. That's nice. Ah. Alright. And kill that Wallywog. What? It's not dead. There we go. Alright. So take that. And then I'm going to take my white. And I gotta use my radar for this because it's underground. Getting closer. There we go. Alright, this treasure right here. And I can just ditch that guy right there. Okay, there's a treasure right there that's hidden underground. Um, a lot of people miss it, so don't be one of those people. Alright, and I can get all my reds on there. I just want to get this back fast. Alright, so, another above- No! Absolutely not. Yeah, there's a lot of polywogs in here, so... Don't let your pick and fight them, because they can get really, really, really annoying. Trust me. Oh! Yes! Make a weird sound when you kill them. They're like, Alright, alright. Alright, how many blues do I have? Uh, 24 blues. Oh, I think one of them, one of my blues took, I think it took one of the Wally Wogs back to the landing site, whatever. Just go retrieve that, and the treasure should be getting in just about now. Woo! Hooray for calling! Alright, so, what is this? Fortified Delicacy. Alright. I don't really see how that's a delicacy. I don't really see how you can eat that, but... Oh, well. Alright, there's my one blue. Now, let's just head over to this cave. And take it down. Alright. I thought this part was only going to be like seven minutes, because... I'm going in this cave and such, but whatever. Guess it'll be longer. Alright, and with all my... Wait, what? Uh, oh, oh. 
Got a little bit worried there. I thought I was missing some. Shower room. All four hazards. So you're going to want to bring all types of Pikmin. Except for reds, because fire is easy to take care of. But anyway, as we jump into this cave, I will say see you guys in the next part. And thanks for watching.